Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the world of Cyberpunk 2077. This is my... Oh. Flaming Crotch Man is calling me. Hey! It's, it's me. The guy who... You know. Uh, the guy with the smoking crotch? That's one way to put it. Wow. Anyway, just calling to say I transferred the funds. You doing okay? Well, did they manage, uh... To save your, um, you know. Yeah. Hell? Much as they no. could. No way. At least the pain is gone. Sorry. Uh, anyway, I'm once it heals, no. I'll get a better model. Something top shelf. Huh? <laughs> Why the hell would you do that? Um, is that a trick question? Why does anyone get a Mr. Stud? To keep Splash back down at the urinal? <laughs> Forget I asked. See ya. That's it? That's it. <laughs> I thought there'd be like a follow-up mission or something. No. Just a stupid random phone call happens out of nowhere. Alright, so. After playing this game all day long yesterday. Seven plus hours. I have mixed feelings about it. You know, I'm playing it on PS5, so I'm not having a lot of the graphical issues that everyone else is having. And I feel that I am probably enjoying it a lot more than other people who are playing the game and having issues with it, run like shit, crash constantly, etc. Um, and I'll, I'll say this, the story mission I did last night was pretty good, and I'm looking forward to more. In fact, that's what we're going to do today. I'm going to focus on the story mission rather than focusing on anything else. I want to go right to the next story mission, okay? But for me, the graphics are like the best thing about the game so far. The 60 frames that it runs on PS5 and... Seeing all this neon shit looks really nice. You know what I mean? The world design is pretty crazy and unique. I mean, look at this. You run into a random exactly. mass killing, right? Um, but the gameplay just isn't really doing it for me right now. Like, the gameplay feels like I'm playing a game I've played a million times before, like Deus Ex or Dishonored, or mixed in with Grand Theft Auto, with a few elements from other games. Like, the gunplay feels kind of like Borderlands to me. And it doesn't feel like the gameplay has a unique identity. The, the the world definitely is unique. And the graphics are pretty damned awesome. But outside of that, I do feel like being here... I mean, even the vending machines kind of look like Borderlands vending machines. You know? Like, everything kind of looks like it's taken from something else. Um, especially when you start doing the hacking and shit. It's like, man, I just did this. I just played Watch Dogs. Right? Um, so for me, I'm not like... I'm not in love with the game. At the same time, I don't hate it. I'm just kind of like, I want to get further in and see how, you know, what happens with it. If it gets any better or worse or whatever. So, today I want to focus in, uh, it's one stream today of the game. Three plus hours of gameplay. And I kind of want to focus in on the story and see if I can advance it to a point where it's like, you know, super interesting or not. I don't know. So you can fast travel. Take a look. You can fast travel to any of these blue locations. That's cool. Right now, you're, you're limited to the central city. I would guess later on in the game, you're going to be able to go to way different places. Look at this. Santo Domingo, Pacifica, Haywood. Right now, city center. Right now, we're focused here in Watson. Westbrook. See, later on, there's going to be all these different areas of the city you can go to. And by the way, I'm just curious. I'm going to ask you guys. Was it ever determined what the city's actually supposed to be? Is it an actual existing city in the United States or somewhere in the world right now? Or is this just a completely originally designed city? Or is this supposed to be like, oh, it's a new thing, you know, a new city? Or, oh, this was supposed to be Chicago, but it's redone now, you know, for the future. It's L.A. Is it supposed to be Los Angeles? If so, I guess that's cool, right? It's supposed to be in Northern California, but it is a fictional city. Okay. So we're in California. Gotcha. Alright, cool to see that we got the fast travel unlocked there. Um, Black Man She-Type did a 100-bit cheer and said, I think this, that folks are being really unfair toward the game. It's buggy, but it's also literally every other open world game is just like that. Especially sandbox-style ones. If you like, what? if you were playing GTA 6, Red Dead Redemption 3, The Elder Scrolls 6, or Fallout 5, everyone would be more... <laughs> Everyone would be more forgiving of it, but it's a new IP, so everyone is being hypercritical. There you go. Thank you for the cheer, Black Man C-Type. The way I see it is, I think people are being hypercritical, but some people have good reason. If you see how this game is actually running on, like, certain consoles, they really have a good reason to be angry at the game. At the same time, I agree with you that 
Other studios kind of got a pass, and this one isn't this time. I don't know. See him full to me. Three bucks says hot tip. If you have a full inventory, call your car, go to the trunk, and you can deposit stuff in there. And you can, and if you need something for your stash or vice versa, it's like a mobile bank. That's interesting, CM Fool. Thank you for telling me. I did not know that you could basically have access uh, to your car trunk, you know, and it would be your stash. So, awesome. Thank you. We're up to $6 in tips now. By the way, I think every single tip is CM Fool so far today. So, thank you for that. Micro Penne just subscribed to the channel. Sorry to hear that, but thank you for the sell. Um, Ripley Atomic Cherry said, Curious, what are some things... I it's doing the same that could do differently. Well, the gunplay. Like I said, the gunplay feels like I've done it in, in other games. It doesn't have anything unique to the gunplay at all. Um, the hacking, I've already hacked. I just hacked in Watch Dogs Legion. I've hacked in, in, in uh, Deus Ex. If it was a different kind of hacking, maybe it would be more interesting, but it's not. It's kind of the same exact thing on the fly, just hack during combat. Um, again, it just feels to me like I'm playing other games. It doesn't feel unique to me at all. Shoei Cheering said, I get a lot of Las Vegas vibes when playing it. I think you're, you're thinking Sin City, Neon Lights, that kind of real gaudy, over-the-top businesses. You look tense and exhausted. Looked like you just ran a marathon. Something happened? Years of merc work, and yet <clears throat> still sweat like a roasted pig when I talk to my mom. <laughs> Can't help herself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. The more I tell her everything's okay, the more I feel like I'm straight up lying. Wait a minute, don't, were those subtitles bigger yesterday? <laughs> I feel like those subtitles were larger. Maybe I'm wrong, but... They were! What happened? The game defaulted. Look at that. I had my subtitles at 72, and I had the background opacity as 50. The game reset my settings. What the hell? It reset all my settings! Disable copyright and music is off. It's supposed to be on. Dude, it reset all my fucking settings. Why did it do that? I gotta put it on... I gotta put it on the, the mode so I don't get in trouble. Dude, what the fuck? Why did it do that? That's not good at all. So let me take a look here. Internet, where was all the settings that I was doing? This is just controls. Gameplay. Uh, let's see. Uh, weapon sway. Graphics. Video. Interface. Uh. Oh. I did that. Disable cover. Where is the turn off nudity and shit? Is it gone now? What the fuck? Where? I don't even know where it is in the options. Right? I don't see it. <clears throat> At least I got rid of the copyright and music, but where's the where's the nudity and, and shit? It's not even here anymore. Right? <laughs> Am I blind? I don't see it. This is controls. That's not going to be it. Gameplay. There's no option for it, then how do you turn it on and off? <clears throat> well, here, here, hold on. Let's save the game. Why did it undo all my fucking settings? Is it going to undo my settings constantly? <laughs> Seriously. But... So exit to the main menu. <clears throat> do you do it from the main menu? This is really stupid. <laughs> oh my god. Well, there's already new stuff. <clears throat> HUD visibility. So this save now, it did. Here it is. Okay. You have to go to the main menu to enable it. 
<clears throat> okay. Everything else is good. Now, did it save? Let's check. Yeah, it did. Okay. <sighs> wow. That is really dumb. Called Kujira or the whale. Apparently, the corp figured it wasn't safe and. See, I knew as soon as the subtitles popped up that they were like way smaller. I'm like, wait a minute. I purposely made these bigger so it'd be easy for everyone to read. But that's done after tomorrow. After life. Here we come, baby. <laughs> okay. It seems to be sticking now. What the hell? All right. Um, CM fooled to me dollar thirty said Night City is San Diego and LA and Santa Barbara and twelve other cities. Uh, sounds pretty ridiculous considering no none of them are near each other. But okay. Okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. I said every time I found a game bug, I was gonna talk about it, right? fuck are the symbols here we go So, big issue. The game completely reset my settings for no reason, and DMCA can still apply if this happens. A pretty bad bug, in my opinion. It is. It's a very bad bug, because you wouldn't even realize it. You wouldn't even realize that your settings got changed, then it starts playing your copyright music, and now you're screwed. Now you get taken off of Twitch, you get taken off of YouTube, even though you thought you had the mode on, because the game reset your mode. That's fucked up, right? That's pretty fucked up. So. So I'll say how often does one need to keep re- setting this there you go okay <clears throat> so yeah big issue the game completely reset my settings for no reason dmca can still apply if this happens a pretty bad bug in my opinion how often does one need to keep resetting this that's terrible you'll think you're safe because you set up the mode to not have copyrighted music and then it'll hit you anyway that's fucked up <clears throat> okay so anyway, then you see him fool already added that tip. Spartan Kings, you can register this with GOG no matter where you bought it. I bought it from Best Buy. I, okay. I don't need any free in-game shit. 
Carlton Jr. chooses to be fear you haven't experimented with the cyberware and the smart tech power weapons yet. Once you get into it, I think the game will feel more like it. Well, I don't even know how to do that. Yeah. Ah, this is it, the Major Leagues. Street we Kid Dialogue. The Major Leagues. <clears throat> Does not get any higher, chum. And you know something else? <clears throat> we fucking earned it, mano. Ready to get your cherry popped? Yeah, come on. The Heinz fellow Jackie. Okay. Place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Really, Jackie? What? I told you that myself. Huh. Oh, for reals? Ah, oh, shit. That must have been ages ago. And who might you clown? We're friends of Dexter Deshaun. He's expecting us. Yo, Dex. Got two live Ow. ones saying they're here to see you. <clears throat> yeah? All right, then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Way ahead of you, viejo. <laughs> this is it. The bar. Georgia Night City. Beating. Hear it? Can you imagine? Susan Forrest, Boa Boa, maybe even Morgan Blackhand. All sat on those stools. Fell asleep on that same It's bar. just a fucking bar, Outside who cares? <laughs> hey, you see that old lady there? That's Rogue. Best fixer in all the night city. Thought Dex was the best. Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> Place belongs to her. What can I get you? You yeah. order. <laughs> Two tequila old fashions with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. Why would you want well, beer in your tequila? Coming up. Right on, chica. Oh, they're called Johnny Silverhands? Uh-oh. Somebody did their homework. <laughs> Looks like the dog ate mine. Age-old tradition. <clears throat> Drinks are named after our regulars. Ah. This might be the oldest club in Night City. How long's the afterlife been around? Uh -huh. Half a century? Longer. Don't know by how much, though. That'd be the oldest club in Night City. And the most respected. Don't forget that bit. Okay. What do you have to do to get your own drink? Say I wanted a drink named after me. Uh -huh. What would I have to do? Snuff it. Mind-blowingly spectacular <clears throat> fashion. Hit up and be best. Ah, what a beautiful tradition. Drink tonight's city to get any filthy rich to the heist of a lifetime. Huh. Guess dying's a small price to pay for going down in history. Now she said she said snuff it, meaning die, but Johnny Silverhand obviously is alive because he's gonna be in the game. We know that's the Keanu Reeves character, so. <clears throat> See him fool to me, dog. Did he say in the USA they have less than a thousand cities, the rest of them destroyed or merged? You know a lot about the lore of this game, don't you, CM Fool? <laughs> Thank you for the tip. <clears throat> he knows a lot. Okay. I live like a legend first, though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. All right, tonight, city. I don't want them to. I don't want anyone in this bar to know that we're gonna do a heist. So just say tonight, city. Tonight, city. And the afterlife. <laughs> Just tequila with beer oh, in by it. By the way, <laughs> it's Jackie Wells. You want to write down my recipe? Hmm, sure. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer. Oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. <laughs> <laughs> I'll remember that. You idiot. I heard you were Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. Mr. Deshaun, see you oh. now. Whoa. Oh, okay. Break a leg. Thanks. Dex's bodyguard just showed up. <clears throat> Whoa, it just got quiet in here. Where'd all the atmospheric noise go? It all disappeared. Damn, Holmes. You're huge. Work out? Mm. <laughs> Same here. No, in the ring. You do some kind of exotic shit? Kempo, ninjutsu. Mm. Think you can take me? Drop me? In here. <laughs> 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 
Friend of Lachuti said, when Cholo Samurai mixes with Cerveza with tequila, it becomes Cholo Sake. What? The fuck are you talking about? That's anyway. right. Excelsior. <clears throat> oh, look at this. A soundproof room. He's got soundproofing foam on the walls. I know because I have it behind me right now. Whole family in one place. Ha! Finally! First time in real space. And the flathead. Let's see this bad boy. I can't sit down. I want to sit down. They won't let me. Put the flathead down. I just took a suit. I didn't mean to do that. I grabbed the suit by accident. Such a <laughs> down comfy. Sit. Okay. <clears throat> Sweet booth. It's soundproof. Jackie. Now, now. Mr. Wells is right. We're going to be going over some sensitive material. But if it's all right with y'all, I'd like to start with a question for Mr. V. Evelyn Parker, how'd you fare? Pretty well, Sunk of Pecky Plaza from the inside. Not bad, but she wants you to cut you loose. I'm just going to tell him the truth. Couldn't have gone better. <clears throat> In fact, she liked me so much, she made me another offer. <laughs> Another offer? Mm-hmm. Kind where we ditched the middleman and split the pot in even 50-50. What? <clears throat> Ditch the middleman? <laughs> <laughs> Shit, now that's rich. <laughs> Clients never learn, do they? I do appreciate you sharing this info, though, Mr. B. I feel like this See, is the right way to do it. Don't screw him over at all. He's essential in any <clears throat> partnership that's to be long lasting and fruitful. I agree. You're, he was the one who brought you the work. Why are you going to screw him over, right? So I think I did the right thing by actually being honest with him. Hello? Oh, uh, see him. Oh, sorry. See him fool to me. Another doctor. He said, no spoilers. Keanu Reeves' character. What? Oh, okay. I'm not going to read that. <laughs> don't, dude, don't give spoilers. I don't want to read that because people might want to know about his character later. I don't want to spoil that, so don't talk about that shit. Okay. <clears throat> Go on now. Don't be shy. All right. Um. Wow, look at this. I'm going to ban this idiot. We got a lot of idiotic trolls today on the stream, guys, so I apologize for that. I just got to ban a few idiots here. Okay. All right, so... Uh, I'll say, don't you be pissed off. I thought you'd be pissed that you'd lose it. I lived in NC too long to blow my top every time some amateur thinks they can take me for a ride. <laughs> Parker ain't the first, and sure as hell won't be the last. Okay. I mean, he called himself Mr. Cool, right? So I guess it makes sense that he's supposed to be the cool guy in town. He doesn't go crazy over shit like that. How about we go <clears> over <throat> the plan? What you got for us, Dex? This. Huh? Take a shard. Well, okay. here goes nothing. Me and Dex have already covered the fine deep. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. A Delamain will drop your asses at the front door of Kentucky <clears throat> Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Okay. Then, with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. Goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. <laughs> so how do we get into the penthouse? How do we get into the penthouse? Yorinobu's got barely any muscle. Hardest part will be penthouse security. Which you already know about. If we want to disable, we'll need to neutralize Kompeki's dweller. Elite runner monitoring the hotel subnet 24-7. Only catch is there's no way to get in the dweller's den from the outside. Hold on. How you want us to get inside a room you can't get into? Trust me when I say whatever hit you think of, T-Bug solved it already. This is where the flathead comes in. You'll have to get him in the ventilation shaft, guide him to the dweller, and force the dweller to take a break. <laughs> flathead will stay there, jacked into the dweller. But thanks to that, I'll be able to roll out your red carpet into the penthouse. Anything else? So that's what we got this for, to disable the security on his apartment. I see. These <clears throat> new identities. 
Tell us more. What's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Harry Conwell. Ramon? Yeah, okay. What do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms deal. In case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with our Osaka's defense rep, Hajime Taki. Anything else? Delamains are right there in back. Transport's a Delamain. Primus Cab Company in all night city. Not a man. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. Yeah, who needs creepy, nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B in style? And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. If everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. Okay. If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is? The No-Tell Motel. Quiet, no questions asked. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? Okay. Uh, friend of Lachuti said, What's confusing? Jackie's white, but he wears a samurai top now. He talks like an SA. Sake has A B Hello? V above beer, but below tequila. Bad joke, but not really confusing. It was still confusing. Yes. I thought Jackie was Hispanic, but I guess what you're saying is he's not. He's the poser. Huh. Okay. Feel brought up to speed. Perfect. I got a question. When do we get to the real reason we're all here? Now's a good time as any. Fresh talent gets 30% always. But I'm willing to make an exception in your case. I'm gonna cut you a nice juicy 40 as a bonus for your honesty fee. Oh shit, look at that. Sounds about right. That's more like it, Dex. Cut ching, baby. <laughs> Last thing, Kempeki's got a strict no iron policy. Security gates, the works. So you dogs will leave your lead spitters in the ride. Take the flathead inside in its case. Got some deft suits, so you'll look the part too. I just, I just picked it up by accident. The suit. Thanks, D. So, not to count chickens, but why don't we see our eddies? All depends how Miss Parker avails herself of her role. But a week, two tops, is my guess. And what do we do while we sit around, suck air? You sit tight, heads down, because old Uncle Arasaka be watching. Now, as that old Greek dog says, life's a banquet. So don't go thirsty, but don't get drunk either. Your chariot <clears throat> awaits outside. <laughs> my cue to Delta Two. Got a prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. Any other issues? Now's your chance. Uh. You and Dex, what's your story? You and Dex know each other a while. Um. Why? Uh, you know, people say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius, I think. <laughs> you and Dex both philosophize in it. No wonder you get along. So, we didn't get any answer there. Thanks for your help back at the scav haunt. A few Reapers less in the city. Good thing. <laughs> city Hall should be fucking thanking us. Any thoughts on this plan? plan. What's your take? Enough, I hope, to put me in a luxury Cretan villa from which I'll never set foot in cyberspace again. Promise to send me a postcard? <laughs> no offense, but I'm gonna burn any and all bridges. Need a clean break. So here's the thing. If this heist went well, they'll make enough money to be set. Obviously, you know it doesn't go well, because if it did, what would the rest of the game be? Sitting on a, on a beach sipping a Mai Tai? Of course not. So obviously things are gonna go wrong here, right? <laughs> <clears throat> okay. So see him fool to me another dollar thirty says all AI is outlawed everywhere. Artificial intelligence is outlawed in the game? Really? Okay. Thank you for the ten for another tip. Now we're up to ten dollars in tips. So I like how they how they, they respond when you're just sitting there, you don't say anything. They act like you're, you're what are you doing? I'm good. <clears throat> no questions. Let's get to work. So you ready to get going or what? Yeah, let's do it. Let's roll. No point in waiting. In getting rich, you mean? Okay. To... Let's see what happens. 
Welcome on board this Delamain service. Mm. With Delamain, you leave your problems at the door. Oh, bitch. Better fucking believe I will. <laughs> I see no reason why you should be using expletives. Oh, yeah? What about that time I wanted to hire you for my cousin's bachelor party, huh? Unfortunately, we do not take on such contracts. <laughs> Three months I've been <clears throat> saving up scratch. Yeah, water under the bridge. Hit it, Del. Before we begin our journey, I must verify the identities of all customers. Please proceed <sighs> to connect your personal links. Okay. Thank you. Excelsior package activated. Excelsior? Oh, this just keeps getting better. What's that? Excelsior. The Excelsior is a package tailored to our premium clientele. Top quality don't come free, you know. Now watch. Delamate, initiate combat mode. My apologies, but you do not appear to be in any sort of imminent danger. <laughs> huh. Oh well. Trust me, you'll mow down an army of Zaka ninjas if it comes down to it. Uh, what else does this include? Excelsior. What, what was that stream? <laughs> comprehensive health coverage, including the handling and disposal of a client's remains should death occur on board. <laughs> she got dark pretty quick. Why would death occur on board? Dex ain't skimping, is he? <laughs> and thanks to you, we're still getting a juicy 40%. You're welcome. Yeah, because we were honest with him, we got some bonus payout. This is how you want to cruise into the major leagues. I wouldn't get overly excited. Hmm? Haven't gotten there. Not yet. I don't know, Jack. Kind of feels like you're losing that steel grip of yours. Huh. Seems to me like it's you who's got some kind of problem. You need to keep your head in the game, yeah. I need you to keep your head clear and in the game. We got a job to do. It's never, ever been clear in my whole fucking life. Let me explain something to you, V. My whole life I've spent in this shit around us. We are nearing our destination. Uh, going <laughs> back. Yeah, he wants to get out of this life, basically. <clears throat> oh, T-Bug? Hey, how's things? Smooth as fucking sandpaper. We'll be, uh, pulling up to the hotel soon. Listen, set up a direct encrypted line to guide you through Kopecky. V, ring Jackie now, see if we're in sync. Can't be too careful. Okay. Look at his eyes, they glow when he the call. Hmm. Got static. Say something, Bug. The greatest crimes issue from a desire for excess and not from necessity. Say what now? Aristotle. <laughs> Guess you read me then. Yeah, I read you. Not so much your Greek friend. Though it was kind of exciting. Could give it some thought. Try to understand. How about you, V? Ah. I want more Aristotle. I want more Aristotle. <laughs> Fuck off, Bo. Yeah. Okay. Tech checks out, looks like. Será mejor que sí. Stay in touch. Thank you for choosing the Delamain service, and best of luck. I shall await here for your return. Okay. It's finally so, so let me guess, everything's gonna go wrong, and Delamain has to get them to safety. It's gonna be hilarious, because the car will be, like, doing crazy shit, I bet. I almost guarantee it. <laughs> All right, Harry. Let's go. <clears throat> All right, let's see what happens. My name is. Hold on. Let me grab the flathead. Okay. All right, Delamain. See you later. When you gotta save our ass. Even this car looks old. The design of the car is very old. <laughs> We're out front, Bug. Member, reservations in your name, Ramon. You're there to meet Hajime Taki, military tech department rep. Papers are for the flathead. Don't worry. Got this. Welcome to Compeki Flat. Well, thank you. <laughs> How nice. Welcome to Compeki Plaza. Please come through single file. Yeah, we have no weapons, you so we'll be hold. fine. Uh, <clears throat> sir? <clears throat> Hold on. Got something. 
Sir, care to explain why you're bringing a combat bot onto Compeki Plaza premises? We're arms dealers. Excuse me? Ah, <laughs> uh, you are here to see Taki-san, am I right? Please, accept my apologies for the confusion. <laughs> should only take a moment, sir. Oh, look at that. Blurs your vision when they're scanning you. Go ahead. Dude, he's like completely metallic. Look at his face. Oh my god. Solid gold. That's creepy, dude. Why would you want your body to be solid gold? Ugh. Yokoso. Greetings and welcome to <clears throat> Kompe Another one. <clears throat> We'd like to check in. <laughs> of course. Just a moment, please. The name on the reservation is? Victorino. Double room, two adults, one night, correct? That's the one. Perfect. I'll go ahead and notify Takisan of your arrival. Shit, no good. Not part of the plan. Talk her up, V. Stall. Ah. That won't be necessary. We'll go freshen up first. Notify him ourselves. But Takisan is expecting you. No? <laughs> Senorita, do you know how long we've been traveling? 18 hours from New Barcelona. With the delay on Medici because some cyber cycle blew himself into bits inside the terminal. Oh, a nightmare. Of course, I understand. You'll be in the Lapis Lazuli suite on level 40. Lapis Lazuli? Oh, one more <laughs> little formality. Please validate your SID chip. Hunter's all yours, Harry. Okay. We have the fake chips. <clears throat> Everything seems to be in order. We wish you a pleasant stay. They didn't validate his chip. What the fuck? Better get going. That's right, Minecraft. La Pis Lazuli. Refuse to mine in Minecraft. Right? That's the magical component. New Barcelona, really? It's called improvising. You should try it. <clears throat> what do you think, Harry? Hmm? Quaint. Cozy. Not like the hotel we had in Zurich for that convention. See, the lighting is glitchy. You see that, right? Look at the lighting, how it's popping as I'm walking. So I don't think it's supposed to be like that. I think eventually they'll fix that. How it pops like that. I don't know if that's their intent. That doesn't look like it's intentional. It looks like there's some kind of a glitch in the lighting system. That car don't look too shabby. Welcome to Compeki Plaza. We don't do reservations weekdays, so feel free to grab any available table. Or a couple of stools at the bar if you prefer. Could bring Misty here one day when we uh, close this deal. <laughs> let's just go to the room. You will, I'm sure. Now let's go check out our digs. I don't want to wander around the hotel. I don't know what the hell's in here. Let's just go right to the room. Art on the walls. Modern art. Someone just took a paintbrush and fucking splattered shit. <clears throat> Looks nice. What the hell is that supposed to be? I don't know. Uh, Nail the part no. or what? <laughs> How do I look? Like a solo cosplaying a unit? Like somebody put <laughs> clothes on a dog. <laughs> oh, yeah, because you look so much better. Wow. See him full tip the doll. Another dollar says, in this, in the lore of the game, companies can force you to get cybernetics against your own will. Yeah, I was wondering why would people want to be completely metal? Maybe this company, if you work for them, they're like, oh, you have to transfer out your your skin to be metallic for for appearances at our job or something, right? That'd be pretty crazy. <clears throat> concierge, the concierge. Yeah. I missed an Easter egg, says Habib Gaming. What did I miss? What was the Easter egg? Well, here we are. La Bis Lazuli. We're in our room. Pretty snazzy. Too bad we ain't staying the night. A wall aquarium? Yeah, look. There's no fish in it. quickest access to the dweller and servers. Oh, it's not an aquarium. It's now like plants growing. And find the shaft entrance. 
Sounds simple enough. Simplicity is sometimes toughest to master. Aurelius? Aristotle? Who's it this time? Yours truly. That one's mine. Where's the chef? Boot up your scanner. Look around. <clears throat> oh, Deo Kojima was in the game? Are you fucking serious? I didn't know that. And I missed it and now I can't do it? Are you fucking for real? I can't go back? I can't. You gotta be kidding me. I didn't know that. How was I supposed to know that? I would have loved to see Kojima in this game. <clears throat> he was at the bar. Oh, that's bullshit. We're just supposed to look for the shaft. Oh, that sucks ass. <sighs> that really sucks, guys. Well, what it is, it is what it is, I guess, right? There's nothing I can do about it. Nothing I can do about it. Pain in the butt. All right, hold on a second. Hold on one second. Let's see. What's the bathroom look like? Chris, you look in the mirror again. Come on. Can't be that hard. Bathtub? Wait, did that say you could do something with the bathtub? No, you just look in the mirror. That's about it. Alright, everyone. Hold on a second. Okay. What is this? A biography of something? <laughs> A biography of some shit. Okay. <laughs> We're just supposed to look for the shaft. I'm confirming a, t a tip, guys. I got a tip, and I just want to make sure that it's real. And actually, I believe it is real. So... Be that hard. Sorry, it's kind of important that I verify that this is real before I continue on. Okay. Alright, I just received a $15 tip. So, thank you to this person who took me 15 bucks. Sorry that it took me a while to confirm it was real, but it is real. Thank you very much. We're off to $26 in tips today. Very nice. Wouldn't Sorry it took a while. To for the shaft? Would you shut up? <laughs> okay. Nothing there, no. Okay. Flathead ready. Flathead prep to go. Almost there, Carnal. What's Kopeki Plaza? Ah. Okay. Another shard. I'm finding all these shards. Okay. So what am I looking for? The sh shaft or something? What did he say? Huh? What is this? Still nothing. Local on, local network hard. sprinkler toggle. Oh my god. Uh Is it supposed to look like that? <laughs> I'm not exactly sure it's supposed to be squirting out of the sides like that, right? <laughs> All right. Anyway, we're just supposed to look for the shaft. Here we go. Got a winner. Good, Jackie. How's the flathead looking? Oh, sick. So we got to pilot this thing now, right? Systems are operational. Charge it hundred. Uh, shout out to Begin Strips who just subscribed to the channel. Begin Strips is like fake, fake bacon, stand right, for dogs. Gonna have to switch to manual control. <clears throat> B, take the control shard from Jackie. Gonna link your Kiroshis to surveillance so you can guide the bot. Take the control shard. Okay. Light lamp just resell for two months in a row, 29 total. Asking about excited for the new Mass Effect. I mean, I'll get excited for it if we have more info about it. Just seeing a silly teaser doesn't mean anything in my opinion. And plus, I don't have much confidence in Bioware right now. So I guess we'll see what happens. Okay. Here goes nothing. Why's it gotta be me? Surveillance cover the whole hotel. I just say, alright, let's do it. <laughs> Here. Here goes. Patching you through to in-cam view. Might get a little disoriented, but don't freak. Oh my god. Great view. 
Okay, got a clear view. You can't just go locking people out of their homes. Get them to the next vent. Places of work. How? Arasaka will cover what the I... cost of any and all what? assessed. What am I doing? This How do you do this? It's How do I control anything? How do you think this will make me look? What the fuck? How do I control it? They never explained anything. District I'm from. A week. That's all we can promise you. We will try. And that is all I can promise you. Okay. So what it's doing, it's going from room to room cloaked, going through the wall vents and shit, in order to get to that room where we gotta knock the guy out and take control of the security in the building. <clears throat> okay, flathead's in. Okay. Patching you into next cam now. Alright. What makes you think it was for you? He addressed it to the kind housekeeper who finds him. Terrarium so panel? said, sorry for the mess. There was blood everywhere. A uh, bug? Got a hit. What now? Am I the only one who just gets puke and use yeah. the condom? Yeah. Okay, got a distractor. Where's the damn uh, justice? Let's see what's on the subnet. Right there. All right, on it. Duh. Terrarium's got a control panel. Thinking. Somehow I doubt it. Who? Terrarium's no. got a temp and air quality controller. Crane, yeah. Sick the flathead on it. Okay. I mean, you're no Don't to do that. Sofa. Men like him are always single. Might wear expensive suits, but he's a biker at heart, always itching for a ride. <laughs> I'd give him a ride and wipe him out. Honey, stick to wiping that glass, huh? You're leaving streaks everywhere. Uh, cat, something's up with the tank. Hey, bug, it worked. Ain't seen nothing yet. You got any idea how much those things cost? Keep moving. No time for backpatting. Okay. There we go. So distracted them with the tank, and then you go through here. Easy peasy. <clears throat> now what? Here he comes. There you go. Under the shaft. Just beyond the door. Flathead can jimmy the lock. Uh, what do we got here? Shaft grate? And the door. Is that the guy we need to take out? <clears throat> Looks like it. Looks like he's having trouble. Shit. Gotta be another way. Let me think. Got another cam other side of the door, but it's disabled. Want me to enable? Yeah, look around for a CCTV port. Right there? Okay. Okay, he's at it. Now toggle over to the other cam. Mm-hmm. Dweller's inside. Just as planned. It's still weird, the hotel's only got one runner. Decent dweller's as good as a dozen rank and file. Net runner chair? Let me neutralize him. Flathead ought to <clears throat> neutralize him. Good thinking. Let me graft a demonoid onto your link. And you know you gotta jack the flathead directly into his chair, right? Make it sound like I'm new at this. Okay, sent. He's all yours. You'll have to get the flathead in there first, though. Okay. Uh... Shaft may link both rooms, looks like. Let's figure it out. Now toggle over to the other cam. Okay. Might have found our way in. Send the flathead over there. Great. Toggle I knew that grate was something. Cam. Why would it be there if it wasn't? There we go. What's for dinner tonight? I think my wife's making tuna casserole. So. Now toggle over flathead into the chair, V. Jack in. There he is. Alright. Take out this freaking. Oh, uh, what's his name? The Dweller. That's what they call him. The Dweller. <laughs> Weird terminology in this game. The Dweller. You sit on his Ooh, face. Got him. Love those demons. Flathead stays, right? To keep an eye on the Dweller, yeah. Punching into Kopecky's main net. You go ahead and log out. Okay. 
Forget it. Así es como se hace. <laughs> How you feeling? Uh oh. Fine. A little dizzy. That's all. What's going on with this stuff? <clears throat> How you doing on time? I think still screwed up. Look. <laughs> you there, bug? Yeah. Yeah. I'm here. What's going on? So listen, ice is thicker than I thought. Piercing it'll take a couple hours. Hours. Couple hours? Can't do it any faster. Want my brain to burst into flames? Just sit down and enjoy your snazzy sweet. Thanks. I will. V, uh, you take it easy, okay? Rest up a bit. What a shitty view. Look at this. It's a terrible view of the city. I leveled up. What can I do here? Leveling up here. Oh, let's see. Perk point and, of course, an attribute point. What do I want to put points into? Uh, I don't know. Maybe I want to increase my intelligence? Increase damage with rifles and some machine guns by 10%. What about shotguns? How do you upgrade sh shotgun damage? Is that later on? It is, because there's sniper rifles. Assault rifle. No, I don't actually see shotguns in this uh in this thing. <clears throat> Which sucks. Because shotguns seem good, right? Moronic Frog says either do intelligence or body engineering for opening doors. Shotguns is annihilation. That's under body. Oh. Rouge's recoil. Shotguns and light machine guns deal more damage. Reduces reload time. I'll reduce the reload time. There you go. Uh, I might do intelligence. Technical, I think I'm good to open doors. Fuck it, I'm doing body again. There. <laughs> okay. Uh, the hated one cheers on the night you cook dinner. What kinds of meals do I prepare? Usually the most simple stuff. Like, I do an, a, a, a Chinese stir fry dish where it's like Chinese style frozen vegetables with some uh, garlic chicken, and I, I'll stir it all up, cook it, add sauce and seasoning, and just put it over rice, you know? Or, you know, I can do very, very simple things. I, I can't do anything too complex. The stuff that I make is very basic. Um, my wife does all the complicated stuff and does a good job with it. So. Shit. The job is to sit. <laughs> sit the fuck down. Whoa! A few hours. Oh, time jump. What do you think? <clears throat> Why'd you give it all up? Yeah, see, look at the lighting on him. It's glitched. What up? It's all around his legs Yori and shit. It's messed up. Arasaka. The good life, I mean. Old news, I know it. See how it's like messing up? Got to I don't know. It could be stylistic, and maybe that's what they're going for, or it could actually be a glitch. I can't tell. If the lighting's supposed to look like that or not. I've certainly never seen lighting in any game look like that before. It's like... Thick. Got everything, right? Eddie's education. Your pops can snap his fingers and... Turn half the fucking planet into a nuclear wasteland. But instead, you're like... Nah, fuck it. And what do you go do? Start a fucking gang. <laughs> Steal dragons or some shit. You goes from your fam... Chip some real skin and... Play gang leader for a few years. For what? Kagabu Kaz says it is a glitch on PC, doesn't do that. So it's an issue with the console version. That sucks. Alright, here we go. Street Kid. Rich Asshole's whim. Why should I care? Ah, fuck him. Why do I need to care about some bougie prick and his Street Kid fantasies? <laughs> <laughs> Must have been a who, huh? I'm Yorinobu Arasaka. Would you folks like to join my gang? Poser with court protection. <laughs> and the name too, Steel Fucking Dragons. Oh man, a wannabe gang goon's wet dream. <laughs> bored of being rich and then got bored of playing tough. <laughs> fucking tourist. Tourist or not, he just walked into the lobby, and we are back in biz. Penthouse security is neutralized. Perfecto. Let's start the show. All right. So we're hey, starting the mission right now. Uh, Here we go. 